come in. Hi. Hi. Come on. So, not that I've been eavesdropping or anything, but I overheard you earlier today when you said you wanted to take things to the next level. I think it's a brilliant idea. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Uh, um, I was gonna wait, but, but wait. No Now, I know this is a business trip, but I can't wait to relax. And look, our villa has a sauna. <laughs> you deserve some relaxation. Oh, I do, don't I? You know, I don't want you to feel any pressure to get me a birthday present, but if you were thinking about I'm moving something. to Seattle, Vicky. Seattle? I know the timing's bad, but I got a great offer from another firm. Wait a minute, Duncan. You've been looking for another job? You always said be prepared when an opportunity presents itself. An opportunity itself. for this company, my company. What are they offering you? It's not about the money. It's about the potential. Potential, Duncan. Are you kidding me? All right. Forget work. What about us? It's already a challenge trying to find time to spend together. And now you want me to get on a plane and fly Vicky, across Vicky, the country? Vicky, Vicky, what? Vicky, I just think it's best we go our separate ways. Sorry. What the f*** just happened? After visiting the gun range to let off some trifling, no-good ex-boyfriend-related stress, I decided to visit my best friend Sophie. We've been friends since high school, and she always knows how to cheer me up. Vicky! Hey! What are you doing here? Come in! I was in the neighborhood showing a house. I thought I'd surprise you. You okay? Yeah, it's me being surprised. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh. How are you two doing? Oh, we are fine. Yeah? Oh, and no nausea this time. Thank oh, God. Good. I see you've redecorated again. Yes. You know, I should hire you to do my show homes. You should. I would love that. Yeah. Yes, especially when school is out, because I have nothing to do. Oh, uh, well, how's Jackson? He's fine. Good. He moved out last week. He what? Yeah, you know, he's 15 now, so we decided that it's best for him to live with his dad. Uh -huh. We. Yes, Kyle and I discussed it and we decided together. It's fine. Are my hydrangeas beautiful? Sophie. What? Look, Jackson wants to build a better relationship with his dad. That's a good thing. But what do you want? Right now? I really want a fern in that corner right there. You know we are not talking about plants. Look, I'm going to have my hands full when this baby comes, and this is just the best thing for everybody. It just is. It, it's good. Okay. So you and Duncan are going away for your birthday this weekend? Duncan took a job in Seattle. Seattle? Yeah, can you believe that? I taught that scrawny little fool everything he knows about real estate. If it wasn't for me, he'd still be in the mailroom. Honey, I'm sorry. But I read this article about oh, women God. who sabotage themselves when they take on men as projects. Well, he needed a job. I mean, how else was he going to take me out to fancy places and buy me things? <laughs> So I know you have your conference in Trinidad, but I hate for you to spend your birthday alone. I don't have to go alone if you come with me to Trinidad. Look, I'm only speaking at the conference one day. The rest of the time, I'm free. Come on, I'm staying in this beautiful villa by the water. Come on, let's party like we used to when we were younger. Like with balloons? No, with the strippers. <laughs> Stop! Come, come on, remember our grown girls get away? Grown girls oh, get away. Oh my god! Oh, get out with Camille and Lauren. Oh my god, that was so fun. Oh, well, then let's bring it back. I leave this Saturday. Oh, I can't go on Saturday. Why? Because I have that dance class. 
Remember, you told me to sign up for the ballroom dancing, so I did. Well, girl, you can dance your ass off in Trinidad this Saturday. Come on. Oh, this is so soon. I mean, what if the girl's not able to make it? It's going to be so expensive. Mm, too much. I only have two tickets. Well, what's a girlfriend's trip without the girlfriends? No, we have to do it when we all can go, and let's do it, do it another time. Okay, so you're going to let me go on my birthday weekend by myself. No, look, it's, I just think we all should go, and it's Camille's birthday, too. All right, fine, if the girls can make it, then I'll pay. You sure? Yeah, well, Camille's got to pay me back. Okay! <laughs> Raise that left leg in the air, knees back. I put my hand up on your hips. When I dip, you dip, we dip. You put your hand up on my hips. When you dip, I dip, we dip. I put Why are you all looking at me? When I dip, you dip, we dip. You put your hand up on mine. It might have been her. She was listening to Big Daddy Kane earlier. I'm sorry it took me a minute. I'm in the middle of yoga. And can I tell you something? These yogis are extremely judgmental. I think I'm going back to Zumba. What's up? <gasps> Sophie and I are going to Trinidad this weekend for a grown girl's getaway. Are you available? My treat. A grown girl's getaway. On you. Hold on, let me check my schedule. Yes, I am available. Will you please <laughs> just send me the info right away? Awesome. I'll email you the itinerary. Bye! Okay, bye. Oh, yeah? You have a stage name to go with that dance? Mom, this is my room. You're supposed to not. Uh, no, this is my room. Okay. I believe those are my shoes. I did buy those jeans. What are you doing with my vest on? Oh! Oh. Hey, girl, what's up? Lauren, Vicky, and I are going to Trinidad for a grown girl's getaway for five days, and Vicky's paying. Girl, I can't get away for five minutes, let alone five days. And I damn sure don't want Vicky paying for anything for me. You know how she is. I got you, girl. You don't need to use your money. Here, let me get this. Let me get you some food. Let me get you something to drink. No, I'm good. No, come on, but it's your birthday. Do you have any plans? Yes, I'm going to do what I always do on my birthday. Go to dinner with Calvin and the kids. Hold on one second. It says you need ten things for the time capsule, not five, Mr. Flick. I know you could count. I'm sorry, I can't go. Maybe next time. Anyway, I think I'm going to be in jail this weekend. Let me call you back. Kayla, I'm going to kill you. Who had the remote first? You had the remote first? Give him back the remote. Y'all need to stop this. Camille, come get your kids. I got work to do. I don't have time for this. Give it to me. I said give it to me. Boy, don't test me. So, I'm in. Islands in the sun. that our bodies are not immune to. <sighs> yes. uh, no! No, Lauren! Your shoes were mine! Oh, leave me alone. Uh, no men, no stress. I can't wait to relax. <sighs> what about you, Sophie? Mm-hmm. No stress. <laughs> I'm gonna have an affair. What? 
Well, you two get to have new haircuts. I should get to try a new man. Camille, don't say that. Okay, well, then I won't talk about it when it happens. <laughs> Lauren? Oh, well, you know me, girl. I just came to party. I, mean, I want to soak it all up. You know, the culture, the music, the food, the rum. Okay, now that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> all right, I'm going to go do my speech for a couple of hours. When I get back, let's party, right? Yes. <laughs> hey, 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 you guys, I hope you have your slippers because these floors are not clean. This place is dirty. They should have got a maid. This entire house has been thoroughly cleaned by me, the maid. Please remember the house rules. There's to be no loud music, no excessive partying, and absolutely no drug use of any kind. Why is she looking at me? Welcome to Trinidad. Oh, thank you so much, Aunt Sophie. Thank you. You are stunning. What is your name? Thank you, ma'am. Can I get one of those? She's not nice. She's just nice. Oh, just Sorry. Put down the Lysol. Camille. Yes. Put down the phone. I need to take some no, pictures. Put down the phone. And for God's sake, Lauren, stop feeling on yourself. I'm hot. All right, we have five days to do absolutely nothing. So what are we going to do? Live it up. I'm gonna be at the bar. The bar? The bar. Mmm, mm, sexy. Come dance with me, baby. Where is she going? She's going to have fun. Well, I hope she stays in her eye line. What is that smell? That's weed, silly girl. Weed? This, who is smoking weed at a dance place? Competition. I'm gonna sign up. You are? Yes. You know you look ridiculous, right? There's too much smoke in here. We're, we're outside. Well, it's strong smoke. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah. Oh, all right. Uh, ladies, are you in line? What's it to you? Well, I'm trying to sign up. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, Lauren, let's just go do something else that's fun. They have other no, fun no, no, stuff no, around. No, 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 this is really fun. Perhaps you should listen to your friend, Dr. Cardigan. <laughs> hey, 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 sister. Do you realize that bullying is actually a form of terrorism? So actually right now you're being a terrorist? Are you a terrorist? Well, did you know? Whoa, 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 whoa. No, here's the thing. If I were you, I would back up. Because there's a new queen of dirty whining in the building, and her name is Lucy Hipsler. So get it together and um, bring it. Excuse me. <laughs> Thank you. What she said. Hello. Yes! We are down to the final four contestants who will be our newest Calypso Queen. Let's give these ladies a round of applause! Woo! Now, ladies, you got 30 seconds to show us what you're working with. It's time to wind! Did you see the way I MJ'd her ass right off the stage? I did, actually. Mm -hmm. You guys, we should know that, Vicky. What? I mean, come on, you know the golden rule. We go together, we leave together. Yes, okay, her. but Vicky is a grown woman. And so. that's not the golden rule. Look, did you see the guy? He I looks did. dangerous. He's fine. And so is she. She's fine along with him. Good night. I'm going to bed. Good night, champ. I don't see how you could just sleep knowing that Vicky's just out there. 
Yeah, you know, I'm not going to be worried about what Vicky's doing. I need to worry about how I'm going to get me some. Camille, you're joking, right? Why would I do that? Have you and Calvin gone to counseling? Oh my God, no. Calvin and I aren't even speaking. And when we do speak, we're fussing and fighting and ar arguing over just everything. Sometimes I just long to be single. I read somewhere that 50% of women who are married with children are unfulfilled. So you're not alone. That's good, because Miser loves company. No, you're not miserable. You're not. You're, you're discontent. Oh, <laughs> thanks, Doc. Hey, make a new party. So what? I can't believe you brought him here. It's after midnight. Uh, I didn't realize I had a curfew. Come on, boo. <laughs> Did he mean for me to go with him when he did that? I cannot believe that she is sleeping with a native on our first night here. Mm, come on, let's go. A minute, would you? Mm. Okay, Lauren, what is wrong with you? I was just checking to see if his pubes had come in yet. No, seriously, I mean, what are you doing with him? Hell, you have done his pants. I think you can answer that question. <laughs> and don't judge me. No, 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 I'm not judging you. So he is very cute. And you know how I feel. Have fun and do you. Damn! What the hell is that smell? Sophie! What? You all right? What did you eat, girl? A dead body? I feel sick. Yeah, well, you smell sick. Leave me alone! Bye, no problem. Oh, my God. Good morning. Well, good morning to you, Sunshine. How are you? No, how are you? <laughs> I'm fantastic. <laughs> wow. Oh, I have so much energy right now, I cannot even tell you. I even woke up this morning thinking, you know what? It would be kind of nice to give Calvin some right now. If he wasn't getting on my last nerve. <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. I mean, quiet as it's kept, that was my thing back in the day. I was oh, okay. <laughs> But then again, it's really nice to not have anybody ask me for anything. Mommy, I'm hungry. Can I get some eggs? Babe, where's my tie? Can I get some now? <laughs> no. Where's Sophie? She's in the bathroom exercising a demon. <gasps> See, I told her to leave all that curry alone. She was like a mad woman at the buffet last night. Man, we have been here one day. I am already the dance hall queen. She's in there crapping her insides out, and Vicky is officially a cougar. Wait a minute. Is he still here? Mm -hmm. Why? Um, probably because he's packing like a Polish sausage. Is that good? Or I don't, I never had Polish no, sausage. No, that's very good. Really? Oh, oh honey. Hi, Boo Boo. I mean, not Boo Boo. Boo Boo is the wrong choice of words. How are you feeling? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. You know, they say, um, diarrhea is a sign of triplets. Oh, yeah. What is that, some kind of urban legend? And I don't have diarrhea. Lauren? No, I, I am not getting involved in this. But you know what? You could probably use a little sunshine. Come on. Good idea. Let's get you ready to go. Come on, babe. Come on. Dead goat in here? 
because in a couple more years, you won't be able to bag anything remotely close to that. Oh, please. Whatever, Camille. Ladies, this is how we deserve to live. Yes, it is. Thank you so much for the stripper. So <laughs> nice to you. Thank you, Vicky. Well, at least you two are very welcome. Hey, you guys. Look, I found this. Beach blowout, grand prize, $10,000. It's a contest and stuff. We should do this. It sounds like fun. No, it sounds like work. I didn't come here to work. I came here to relax. Yes, and I am already a winner. I have nothing to prove. Okay, well, fine. You guys just be lazy and sit around and do nothing. Thank you. <laughs> Aren't we a little old for that anyway? Uh, excuse me. Speak for yourself. I did. And I can speak for you, too, because we are the same age. <laughs> Middle age. Plus, kids take about four or five years off your life, so my days are numbered. Well, uh, I also heard trifling men knock the years off. That, too. Damn, in that case, I could die any day now. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I have had my share of sorry men. Mm. But when I think about it, I really wasn't happy until I was with Malik. Oh, my God. Oh, girl, you know how long ago that was. No, and he cheated on you. With some old skanky girl, I'm sure. And she's lucky I never found out who she was. He was my soulmate. I don't believe in soulmates. What? what? What about you and me? You guys been together for how long now? Four years. Aww. Four years. <laughs> I know that look. Is he still making it happen? What? Really? God. Well, speaking of having sex. None of your business. I know where you're going. Vicki, now I know that you are having sexual intercourse while we are here. I know you are. And I just hope that you are using the proper contraceptive because you don't want to get pregnant by the sun god. And the after-school special is being brought to us by Sophie. Don't worry, she can't get pregnant with powdered eggs. <laughs> Why would you say that? What? You know she wants to have a baby. And obviously it is possible. It was a joke. Goodbye. Stop. Okay, stop, stop, stop. Goodness. Let's yes. go to the water. Come on. Uh, I'm not going in the water. I just did my makeup and I, I don't want my hair to get wet. You know I was drowned when I was little, had to be revived. The whole thing, I'm good. Me, we and the kids, we don't do water. That is sad. And if y'all don't do water, then why are you at the beach? To relax. Remember? Yes. I'm going to get a drink. Hey, listen. How many do you think I need to get a buzz? It's getting expensive. A little stronger, please. Have something on me. If you want more, you want more. Sophie. Hey, Soph. Huh? Hey. Huh? Sophie. Babe, which bag? What? What? I, I don't care. Pick <sighs> Really? You're gonna change your purse right here on my lap? Uh, yeah, because I have to. Oh my to... God, Camille! Really? Okay, you have got to relax or you're gonna have a stroke. Cut it out. Cam Camille, I have never in my life smoked weed. I have never done that. Do you want? I don't want to come in your No, rush. but I don't want my baby exposed to it either. Do you know how much smoke you inhaled last night? Your baby's gonna come out with dreadlocks. It, Just relax. It it's not funny. Hey, okay. you. Dinner reservations in 20 minutes. Okay. So, I'm sorry I don't feel well. It's okay, Nanny. You guys go in there. I'll meet no, you guys outside. Okay. All right. Okay. So, listen, a guy's gonna stop by the house. Mm -hmm. His name is Scully. 
He's going to give you a package. You're going to give him this, okay? okay? It's enough for an ounce. All right? Love you. See you, babe. You think Sophie's okay? Yeah, she's fine. She just wants to sleep. You know how it is when you're pregnant. No, Camille. Actually, I don't. Oh, yeah, she's fine. Scully send me. Hello. You looking for something? Oh no. No. Me. It's been Frank to me. Whatever. Tell me, tell me where you need. Well, she left this money. And she says she needs a pound. A pound? Yeah. <laughs> Y'all partying big. No, we're not partying big. She called management and said we have an hour to get out, so. I can't believe we got kicked out because of you, Camille. Technically, this is Sophie's fault. Sophie? I'm not the one that's fraternizing with drug czars. You are, Camille. Just say no. Just say no. Okay, shh. Calm down. I can't hear. This is Scully. He keeps blowing up my phone. Did you pay him? Yes, Camille. I gave him the money you gave me. Okay, well, I only gave you enough for an hour. Well, how am I supposed to know? I don't know. I don't buy drugs. I don't know what you speak of wrong tonight. Perfect. Okay, thank you for checking yourself. Shinanse. Where am I, money? And listen, it's your little shout and I think not necessary. She say everything was in the envelope. You see all this messing up? You're always messing up. I'm fed up right, all right? Grab my money or else. Good luck. So apparently, there's an IT conference in town and all the hotels are book solid. You guys, I don't even know where else to call. Scully keeps calling. Speaking of which, Camille, everyone knows that when you come to an island to experiment with drugs, you don't give the drug dealer your real number. Really? Everybody knows this? Well, you know what, guys? You guys better figure this out because I am not catching a case because of your two shenanigans. Oh, Just pay the man. She needs to pay him because here's a school teacher who doesn't know the difference between no. a pound and an no. ounce. No. Yes. No, I am not. You should have never got me involved in this illegal drug trade. I can't. Hey, 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 listen, 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 listen. Ralph's uncle has a boutique hotel, and he's pretty sure they have vacancies. Oh, yes! Something's going right. Oh, it's called the palace. Ooh. Oh, oh my God. I know there's a thing. Oh, my God. 
This don't look like no palace to me. Definitely gonna need more Lysol. Man, this is some bull. Look, as much as this place disgusts me, we're not leaving. I didn't pay for this trip for it to end like this. And it's my birthday weekend, damn it! Well, let's not forget, it's Camille's birthday, too. Look, we'll just look for another place tomorrow. Wow. A bar. All right, ladies, okay, it's not the beach, but if we get drunk enough, it'll feel like it. <laughs> my treat. Awesome. No, what am I gonna do? Don't worry, I got you. I'll get drunk for both of us. All of us, really. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes. Ooh. We're not doing no dumb contest. So, what do you guys think? It's nice, right? It's a nice dump. Ah, uh, but we are very thankful. Thank you, Ralph. Thank you. And I used to have a booty like that. How much do you think she gets paid for that? She'd probably get a lot of money, huh? Ow! Ow what the hell? Just... Mm. Mm. Everybody knows you never look a prostitute directly in the eyes. No, no, no. Who the hell is everybody? Look, Vicky, this is a very respectable establishment. It's been in my family for years. There are whores in the lobby. But we, we don't judge. Because um, Camille and I were whores back in the day. We were. We was good, too. <laughs> oh, my God. It's not even like a, a three-star or five-star or even two. Thank you, baby. Thank you. I catch your cheats and ass. Ruth, what are you doing here? I've come to see the fool. You're <gasps> sleeping our own wits. Hey. I am certain you are not pointing your ill-manicured finger at me. Well, I'm certain she did. Ruth, don't start this madness now, please. You in fine, oh you a little too old to be sleeping with my man? Who are you calling old? Okay, hold on, hold on. Ladies, ladies, let's place the blame where it belongs. On Ralph. Hold on. You is not the same dance girl from the club? Yeah, no. What was your name? Fat hips? No, no, no. Honey, it's loose hips. Loose. Or you could just call me winner. Well, <laughs> hello. Ralph. Hello. That's what you like? Fat hips, crow's feet, and a Miss Jane Pittman. Let me tell you something, you broke down. Rihanna wanted oh, me. Oh, <laughs> tell her! Tell her! Clearly, no, no. you don't have what it takes right. to hold on to your mind. That, which is why he's all right. over here up on her old ass. What? Let me tell her this something. <laughs> Say something. One more thing, and you're going to be picking up your grill off the floor. No, please don't. Please don't. One oh, please don't. Please don't. more. No! What's up? Okay, that's right. Officer, we were just here celebrating our birthdays. We don't understand why these girls would pinpoint us as targets. Officer, honestly, I don't know how I'm gonna recover emotionally. And sir, I'm five months pregnant. See? Okay, let me get this straight. Those girls were harassing you all. Yes, yes, yes. yes. But you don't want to press any charges. Oh, no. No, 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 no harm, no foul. We just, we just think it's so sad that girls today don't know how to conduct themselves. It, it, it really is a shame, but, officer, I see it all the time at the shelter where I volunteer. Such a good person. Okay. Well, you ladies have a good night, okay? Thank you, officer. Drive safe. I will. Yes. And please, try to stay out of trouble. We no, we will. will. We will. And you ladies, free to go. They say over here, you know. Miss. You better wash your back. Miss, please. What she said? Yes, please. Since 
like the sixth grade. Camille, you were amazing. You were like Mayweather and Ali and, and a little bit of MMA in there. Oh, oh, yes, oh, yes, amazing. Yes. Oh. Okay, but wait a minute. Did you see the way she went down? Boop. Bye, Patra. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Dang, that was so much fun. Oh, awesome. Y'all ready to go party? What? Girl, please. What? Oh, God. Oh, y'all ain't no fun. I'm about to go hang with the hoes anyway. Hey, listen, what time y'all get off? I think I found the girls you called me about. Yeah. They're at the palace. I can't believe there's not one decent hotel with available rooms. I told you. And the conference is here for another two days. Just wish we could have stayed at that condo. That old housekeeper. She had it out for me from the start. What time did Camille say she was coming back anyway? I don't know, but I'm hungry. Well, you girls are going to have to eat without me because I'm going to Ralph's cricket game. You're dissing us for Ralph? I'm not dissing you. I'm just leaving for a few hours. You are spending the whole grown girl's getaway with a boy. Well, he's a very nice boy. Look what he left me. Oh, my gosh. This is cute. Isn't it cute? He probably spent his whole allowance on it. Ha, ha, ha. Look, you said that this trip was not about men. I did say that, but that's before I realized that the Trini men are so fine. Okay, honestly, I... I wouldn't mind seeing some cute Trini men at a cricket game. Yes, 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 no, no, stop what? it, no, no. I'm not eating alone. I'm not, and you keep spending all this time with Ralph, and you're never going to see him again after we leave. Well, all the more reason. I mean, he is actually thinking about attending school in the U.S. Okay, look, Stella, I've said this before, and I will say it again. You don't need a man to validate I just want to have a good time. Oh, my God. Hi, ladies. Camille, mm -hmm. you look hot. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my God. <laughs> when did you go shopping? I know. Turns out Mama still got it. Yeah, and she should share it with her husband. You spent the whole night out with whores. We were worried about you. I wasn't. Well, I'm fine, Mother. Thank you very much. And speaking of fine, I met someone. Mm -hmm. Turns out he is a lawyer. He took me shopping. And we have a date tonight. Excuse me. <laughs> Camille! What? <laughs> oh, can't wait. You're being too vague. Well, I'm not being anything. I cannot believe you are doing this. I can. Listen, ladies, I'm going to be downstairs. I don't want to deal with this. Well, at least he's a distinguished professional and not a prostitute. He's not a prostitute. I can't believe you would talk to me like that after I paid for the trip. Well, there it is again. If I got to hear one more time about how you paid for this trip, we know you paid for the trip, Vicky. Clearly, you couldn't pay for any class. Ooh, huh? The baby's hungry. You know the what? baby's Can hungry. You, you are sad, sad and pathetic. See, now I'm sad and You pathetic. have to be intoxicated just to get through your pitiful little life. No wonder your husband didn't want to sleep with you. Malik didn't seem to mind. Oh, yeah. What did you say? You slept with Malik? Well, clearly he was tired of your boring bind. That sounds like something a slut would say. Look, you guys, that was 15 years ago. We're no, ladies I now. We're adults. Calling me please. names since since we were freshmen. What? Am I supposed to be hurt now? I'm not. I've already heard it all, Vicky. Oh, Camille, she's just a poor girl from the hood here on scholarship. Whatever. Funny you would say that because you're still that poor little girl from the hood here on scholarship. Listen. What? So no, what? You're gonna come out? You're not gonna do Stop that. It. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop 
what? You shouldn't have said that. Oh, please, Lauren. Don't stand there and look at me like you don't have any skeletons in your closet. When you told me Ethan was married, what did I say? I said, hey, girl, do you. What? And you, pregnant by your ex-husband, hoping to win him back. You two ain't any better than me. In fact, you're worse. At least I'm honest about my issues. Ethan is married? Sophie, I didn't tell you because I knew how you would feel about it, all right? But this is a completely different situation. No. no. I don't even know who you are. Yes, you do. No. We talked about how Cal's affair destroyed us. You sat there and you listened to me pour out my heart. And the whole time, you were doing the same thing. I wasn't doing the same thing, all right? It... it Okay, Ethan is unhappy, but he can't leave, okay? They have a business together, and if he walks out, he'll lose all of his money, and she doesn't care what he does. Is that what he says to you? Is that what he says? It's women like you who destroy it for wives like me. No, all right. Okay, now you are comparing apples to oranges, all right, Sophie, because you left Kyle. No, no I didn't. I didn't leave him. He left me. I didn't have the guts to leave. I would have stayed forever. Yes, he left me for her, and I'm pregnant. You know, it's, it's people like you and Ethan and Cal. You guys prey on women like me. No. Yes, you do. Wives who believe in love and commitment. I loved him. I wanted it to work. Okay, Sophie, I didn't, don't know. I didn't I didn't. I didn't. I'm sorry. Ethan, it's me. Listen, I'm just calling to see if everything's cool. I, um, thought I would have heard from you by now. I left you a message. Actually, left you a couple messages. Um, if you could give me a call as soon as you can. All right. Thanks. Get off the field. No, Ralph, I am ready to go to dinner. It's my birthday. Yo, what you doing? Okay, let me finish playing the game now. How long is it going to be? Stop playing. Oh. Oh. I've it. Oh. 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 Ow! Could you stand on your own? Yeah. Yeah, I can stand on my own. Thanks. So you meet me later?
Sydney are beautiful. Oh, thank you. So, as this is your first time here, what would you like to do? I was thinking we can go sailing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What did you say? Sailing? <gasps> yeah. No, I, I um, I don't do water. I don't go in the water. So, yeah. Oh, uh, so what would you like to do then? Meal. Hmm? I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. You know what? I'm having an all-around bad day. You want to talk about it? Actually, I don't. It's just that my girlfriends and I aren't speaking right now. Like, literally, because of something that happened years ago. I just don't understand, like, why are we bringing this up again? Like, we were pretty much kids back then. Why are we talking about this? Like, we're on vacation and it's just, I don't know. Never mind, it doesn't. Well, maybe if you do talk about it's this. It's just like, really? Really? Yeah. Now we got to talk about this? Like, now all of a sudden this is an issue. It's not an issue, we're just talking, just having a drink. Do you want to talk about it? Not really. What about talking about the water? You know what, I'm sorry. I'm really normally a lot of fun. I'm a lot of fun. I'm, I'm actually a good time, really. I believe you, Camille. Mm -hmm. Oh, well. When am I going to get a chance to see this fun side? So you were sucking on that cherry. I'm, I can't do this. I'm married. Married? Yes, I'm married. I, I'm married. With kids. That's shucks. Multiple kids, actually, so we could just get the check. My cell phone was right here. Here is my. Where's my phone? Where's my purse? Oh my God! Where's your? Where's our stuff? Where is our stuff? Have we been robbed? Oh my God! I think we've been robbed. Vicky. Oh, Ralph again. Vicky, oh. wake up! We've been robbed! We've been yeah. robbed? We can get my shoes Oh my god! Ten thousand US dollars from a weed and my time. But your pregnant friend here going to be in a lot of trouble. Is Sophie with you? Let me speak to her. We don't hurt her. We're gonna call the police. What am I Let's talk to them? Hey you guys. I'm fine. He hasn't hurt me. Do I feel a little sick? This place is filthy here. It's all these mannequins and statues, and he doesn't smell good at all. He actually stinks! You, you wanna call your police for me? Huh? Yeah, so when you call the police and you talk to Sergeant Rogers, my uncle, tell him I said hello. You're a long way from home, birthday girls. Yeah, in my city now. And you have until midnight to get my money. Oh, oh my God. I hope for your sake, your friends get the money. Ooh, what do you have to spit on me? I hope you know that the United States of America, they don't negotiate with terrorists. I have to pee. Mrs. Scully! Okay, 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 okay. What are we gonna do? All right, you guys, they could really, they could hurt 
work, Sophie, all right? So we just give him the money. We just go to the bank and we get the money and we just give it to him. How? Lauren, we can't just walk into a foreign bank with no ID, no passports, and just get money. All right, so we call the police, guys, all right? They can't all be crooked. All right, why didn't I think of that? Why don't we just call the police, tell them we just purchased a pound of weed, but the drug dealer kidnapped our girlfriend because we didn't pay him his money. Yeah, that's a good idea. You want to go to jail? No, I don't want to go to jail. You don't want to go home. You better figure this out. Come here, because this is your fault, you pothead. You are my okay, 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 okay. You're shut fault. up, shut, shut up. up. I know how we can get the money. How? getting ten thousand dollars in one day look if we lose this we go to the police whatever happens happens please this is just the wrong attitude all right we can do this all right just get your mind right and let's win this thing okay come on right? Leo, come on oh, yes fine. let's do it um excuse me sir hi all right Okay, okay, all right. Okay. <laughs> we have some beautiful ladies here. So what's your team's name? Oh, uh, I think uh, we should Birthday be the... Babes. Birthday Babes, awesome. All right, everybody, listen up. Our newest team is the Birthday Babes. Give it up. Yeah. All right, awesome. So these are the rules. Remember, all team members must sign the last page. Uh, the first competition starts in an hour, so good luck! Oh. <laughs> okay. Thanks, Isaac. All right! I would like a box of crackers and water, filtered, please. No. No? Are you, you gonna tell a pregnant woman no, that she's hungry and wants something to eat? Oh, you think that makes you all big and bad? You think you're a big and bad man? Ooh, I'm Scully. I sell weed. I kidnap pregnant ladies, and then I don't feed them. I bring them to my kidnap warehouse, and I just make them starve to death. Well, what if I decided to just have this baby right now? What if I just decided to just push and push and push her out, and here she comes along with the placenta and the birth and the amniotic fluid and the blood and, and then a live baby that you're gonna have to cut the umbilical cord all right enough what do you want i would like a box of crackers and water filtered please okay thank you there is no way they're gonna let us compete without a fourth Person. Well, we don't even know anybody else here. What about Patra? We know her, kind of. Oh, you gotta be no. kidding. Well, do on. you have another option? Hey! I am not fighting again. This time she is on her own. Yeah, she's being not problem. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 